Good morning. Good and morning. It's really morning this time. <laughs> <laughs> it is 10 o'clock and we have made good time. Yesterday was treat day, so today is Sunday. And we usually sleep in on Sundays, but we decided to do a road trip today to go to a mall that's about an hour away shopping for spring and summer clothing. Because as you guys know, usually by the time a new season comes, we need new clothes. Um, Kyle's shirts are getting tight in the arms because he's getting muscles. And <laughs> my you. clothes... <laughs> My sleeves actually get tight too because my biceps are growing. Oh yeah, buddy. And um <laughs> My the rest of my clothes get a bit baggy and they don't fit as nice. So we generally every season have to get new clothing. Um which I'm not complaining about cuz I like going shopping. So anyway, it's not treat day. That's the main point. Um, we wanted to show you a quick video on how to prepare for a day where you're going on a road trip. Um, you might be around people where they're eating mall food because you're at a mall and you're not. So this is how we do it. And we wanted to show you guys this because we've been doing it for five years and before that we were the type of people that said, no way, it can't be done. You can't mm -hmm. eat healthy and you can't stick to your diet or whatever you want to eat when you're you know, going to a party, going on the road, traveling, doing a shopping day. It's impossible, but we want to show you how we've been doing it for the last five years. Exactly. So um, this is exactly what we do. Um, during the day, I drink four bottles of water. So does Kyle. I've already had two. Um, I've already done fasted cardio, so we both have, and we've already both done our workouts for the day. Um, so we're two bottles down, we've already had two meals, and we have the, a couple more in our bag, obviously. So this is my four water bottles in here with my BCAAs. Kyle has one exactly like it, but it's green. His is full of BCAAs as well. Um, so there's your water. No excuses not to drink your water, because it's right there in your big jug. Um, I always like to bring a big bag of stuff because I'm an over preparer. So I bring like, you know, wipes and napkins and Tylenol and um, a Tide stick and salt and pepper. <laughs> yep. And um, stuff for contact lenses. So, um, and we use Renew because it's awesome. So then, once you get that prepared, then because I know we're going to meet Kyle's brother and I don't know if they're bringing their own food or not. They might be eating mall food. So if they are, we bring treats to get us through the day. So we have Coke Zeros um, mm. in there for some caffeine and a treat. Um, we have Jellos as a treat. These are sugar-free, fat-free, and carb-free. There's only five calories in them. Um, and we also have flavored water which has nothing except one carb and this is the raspberry lemon fruit 2 -0. now the secret is to be prepared this is how you do it now we might not get we might not no. eat all these we but, might oops, hey, sorry you're breaking the margin <laughs> but we want to have them if we need them or if we want them or if we decide to stay a bit longer and walk a bit more we might want a, a little extra yeah that's the thing we can prepare to go for a couple hours, but you never know. We're going on a road trip. There might be traffic. It might be really backed up. You never want to have an excuse to have to go get food that's diet, not yeah. your diet. So you bring extra. We might not eat these two meals. We might only need one, but you always bring an extra meal just in case. You always have something, protein powder. And sometimes I carry a cup extra water and protein powder in a baggie in case I ever need a backup meal um, and I keep it in the car. Um, never be without stuff because that gives you excuses. That's a nice purse. Wait a minute. That's oh, not a purse. It's not a purse. Well, it um, could be, but it's a lunch bag. So there's too. one meal where Kyle and, eat veg uh, blah, blah, blah. Kyle and I eat veggies and, pr and uh, protein. So in here we have half a slice of Swiss cheese and six slices of deli meat. These are all lean. They only have one and a half grams of fat for three slices. So three grams of fat for this baggie of six. Um, three turkey, three ham. There are no carbs in this bag, friends. 
and um, like 80 calories or something silly, and like three grams of fat. Um, yeah, so there's yeah, so the we bag. just put each, you know, each our servings in a bag. Yeah, so one's my serving and one's Kyle's. And it'll all stay nice and cool in your purse cooler. <laughs> this is a whole cucumber. We'll be splitting that, and that's what the salt and pepper is for to go on our cucumbers. Um, and we also packed a little container of mustard for dipping our deli meats in. And that's Dijon. Mustard. Gee, you think of everything, don't you? Yep. Spoons and forks, of course. And our famous Tupperware that you guys have seen many, many times before. I can't get it out. And Sorry. where did you get this? This actually holds a lot, eh? Um, I got this from Winners two years ago. So, yeah, it's lined and it's uh, pretty cool. It was like $18 or something. We bring, we've bring, we brought in this to We bring so it everywhere. And it holds a bunch of stuff. And it... Care, yeah, and it it holds weight because we're like, if we're out for hours, we're eating all the time, so it has to be you know good. It has to hold a lot of stuff. We got a mix of veggies, broccoli and green beans in there, uh, rice and chicken yeah. breasts. Yeah, so I eat. I just have we have different color lids because I eat a bit more meat than Nicole, yeah. so that's why they're different. Okay, colors. so that is what we have now because. It was treat day yesterday. Um, I've eaten a, I've eaten my post workout meal. I have not eaten my yogurt, which I usually eat after my fasted cardio. But I was still full from yesterday. Like I just wasn't hungry yet. So I'm gonna bring that yogurt on the road and eat it when I am hungry. And sometimes after treat day, sorry, we do do that because we ate so many carbs the day before we don't really get hungry too much in the morning. We usually sleep in on this day. It's the only day we allow ourselves to sleep in. So, um, cause we're up early and we're done everything, not too hungry yet. But when I am hungry, I'll have tons of food to keep me going and no excuses. That is the goal. Never leave yourself excuses to go off of your plan. And you just gotta be a little prepared and then yeah. you, can, you can do it guys, cause we've been doing it. And that is how you, that's how we can eat like this six days a week, not touch any of the treats over on our treat shelf until treat day. Because we never leave home without food, water, backup meals, um, there's never an excuse. We don't allow ourselves to have excuses. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, don't forget to check us out on Instagram and huh, don't make this no no. <laughs> don't forget to like and subscribe because you know about it. My fist of doom. Boom! Thanks Bye, for, friends. Thanks, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.